David Menzies for the Rebel News here in Toronto. Well, folks, I'm standing outside the Scarborough Centre for Alternative Studies. That's a Toronto District School Board uh, run facility for adult students exclusively. And what brings me here is that last week, in the days leading up to December 6th, which of course was the anniversary of the horrific Ecole Polytechnique massacre in Montreal in which 14 women lost their lives, the display that was erected here at this school was vandalized. There was graffiti written over it that was very misogynistic in nature. Well, the four people who allegedly did that are now being charged by police uh, for mischief. But the thing about this story is the amount of secrecy, if you will, and the lack of media coverage about this uh, particular story. For example, you have to wonder if one of the reasons the suspects have not been named by police, even though they've been charged, and the fact that no images of the vandalism exist is maybe because some of that vandalism represents the kind of diversity the liberal left and the media party are a tad uncommon talking about and by that what i'm saying folks is that some of the words written on the display were in arabic including such words as slut and whore so we don't know um who's done this unlike the vandalized cenotaph outside of um, old city hall last month i can't get my hands on any image I uh, went into the school and uh, nobody was there to help me and they were even evasive in uh, saying whether or not the display still exists. So I just have to wonder if this is the new normal going forward, if there is a crime or a thought crime being committed, perhaps by those of a diverse uh, community, then better not to spend too much time on that and just carry on with our lives as though nothing ever happened. For the Rebel News, I'm David the Menzoid Menzies. Hey folks, if you like the kind of coverage we bring you here at the Rebel News, the kind of coverage you simply don't get anywhere else when it comes to telling the other side of the story, then why not become a premium content subscriber? Please visit premium.rebelnews.com. That's premium.rebelnews.com. Sign up and never miss another Rebel video.